um, how to be healthy. You know, you have to empower yourself, not only with your job, but basically also what you do with your lifestyle. And it's actually to be healthy. So it's what you eat, how you feel, who you're with. And one way is actually to have an annual checkup. And Healthway Medical actually provides that. So again, our special guest today is the Vice President for Sales and Marketing of Healthway Medical. We have Miss Carmi De Leon. Hello, Miss Carms. Hi again, Mary Beth. I know. We talked about a lot of things today. It's yeah. super exciting. I mean, from from you launching a book, I mean, it's amazing. It, you have like your stories to share mm -hmm. and it's not going to be a period because there's going to be a yeah. part two. Watch out for the second, My Beautiful Mind. Yes. And then um, aside from that, you're busy again with Healthway Medical right now. Again, mm -hmm. new services are being offered for the kids yes. and now also for the, the, senior. yeah, the senior citizens. Um, and also, of course, th those who are currently working um, in the, their prime years, you could also uh, go for the executive checkup or what they call the health check. Mm -hmm. And um, again, there's a lot, of, uh, a lot of other programs like the vaccinations. Yes. So if they don't have time or they don't know of a doctor, they could also... So just check out Healthway Medical. Uh -huh. um, how do they get in touch with you know the company? Do you just go to the website? Visit our website. It's a www.healthway.com.ph, and um, it's very interactive because there's live chat. So you can just live inquire. Chat. Yeah, live chat. At this very moment, you chat them tell us if they are not responding, but they should be. Okay. Um, so they can ask. They can also see our Facebook. Um, we will uh, get in touch with you. Great. Okay. And aside from that. Um, Healthway Medical is going to be very, very busy with mm -hmm. a lot of people this year, especially the corporations. Yes. So what is happening? Okay, on um, on Saturday, January 30, we will be having our Dance for Health Tree. Okay. This is the third year that we're doing this. Um, it's the biggest dance competition among corporations. So I mentioned about sleep, eat right, exercise, distress. So this is one part of it. And um, there will be na uh, 10 dancers, 10 groups from different companies, plus, of course, the Healthway team. Okay, you're, uh, the, the Healthway team, um, these are employees the Healthway who are also dancing. Yes, the nurses, IT people. Wow. Yeah. Okay, um, and uh, is it already closed, like the registration? Or what um, about it's close already, but okay, I don't but know. You can just contact me. Maybe we can just, if there are interested parties, maybe we can just consider that. But we just close the um, sending of entries. Okay. But I think we can still accommodate if for those really who are, yeah, to. if they really want. And if they're watching right now, just uh, message our, um, visit our Facebook, Dance for Health Tree, or Healthway website. And then or Healthway Philippines. Signify your intention. Yeah, Healthway Philippines Facebook. Okay, so um, when did Dance for Health One happen? Three years ago. Why did you? Why did the Healthway organize such an event? Uh, it's part of our anniversary um, celebration. We used to have golf tournament. We tried fun run. We okay. tried badminton in the mall. Okay. We tried a lot of things like healthy cooking. And oh, then, okay. Okay. yeah, okay. and then uh, we, we actually decided to have Dance for Health and um, push through with this because it's actually the easiest way to stay healthy. Because when you dance, even in your own private home or in the bathroom before you take a bath, you can just do a little dancing. Yes. It's the cheapest way to exercise and to de-stress. And uh, it's for everyone. Because if it's badminton, there's only a group of people who, will, who might be interested. So we decided, why not dance for health? And then, why not corporations? Why not the employees? Because employees are also, you know, um, the stressful job, the deadlines and everything. And most of the time, these employees, they have sedentary lifestyle. Right, right, so we right. decided to inject this agility thingy right. and then invited them. And then that also here, promotes here camaraderie we are. And yeah, the it's end, actually course. fun when you rehearse after office hours. Because I do that for my health weight team. And you're going to be dancing too, right? Of course. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And, and um, we have questions right now because we have students who are asking, um, is this just for corporations or can student organizations join yeah. the competition? Um, when we started Dance for Health, we actually thought about students. Okay. But it was overpowered. You know, the students overpowered the corporate people. And we oh. decided to focus on the, the not so young, not so young ones and the more stressful Group. The ones who need to just ex, yes. you know, exert the, the kind of energy. Correct. And, so we prioritize right. corporations. Maybe in the future. Maybe in the future. Maybe it could be a separate. Um, yes. Maybe when you have the junior checkup already. Maybe. And then, yeah. Know, so watch out for it. 
Right. Okay, so we do have questions with regard to, um, again, how, when will be the next Dance for Health if they can't join this year? Uh -huh. So it's going to be next year. Do they have one year production? Yeah, it's going to be next year. So you have ample time. You can prepare as early as now. I suggest that you gather your friends or your office mates. They have to because be this office is, mates, right? Yeah, because this is for companies. Okay. So for regular employees. So it has to be, um, the contestants have to be of the same company. They can't be like friends from different companies. Yes, it should be from one company oh, okay. at least four and maximum of 12 12 yes and what kind of dances should they present no particular genre so they can depends perform. on what they want depends on their specialty so like if they're hip-hop or belly dance or, or ballet. ballroom ballet depends there is no um, it's not a criteria and then, of course, you have a, a, a highly esteemed panel of judges. Of course, yes. Uh, we invited several, uh, at least three to four judges. Who are also um, really into choreography and dance. Yes. Wow. And when, where again is this going to be? It's going to be in Alabang Town Center this Saturday, January 30. What time will it start? Uh, by 1 o'clock, we'll be starting the program already, but, but we will be there earlier. There will be booths from our partners, okay. and they can avail of freebies okay. and free sam samples. And for those of you who will be also in Alabang area, I mean, they can already inquire about Healthway, right? I yes. mean, what kind of um, services? We have a clinic there um, also, on the second okay. floor. In Alabang Town Center. Yes. Okay, and of course, um, to our future contestants, they're already asking, there are prizes to be won? Oh, yes. Actually, um, number one, it's free to join. There's no joining fee. Ah, no registration so you fee just all. Yes, because we're afraid that HR will have this reason that it's not budgeted. So we're offering this for free. But then the price is 75000 for the grand winner. 75,000 yes. pesos. Uh -huh. 75,000 and the bragging right, of course. Right, of course. But imagine, people, yeah, imagine, exactly. imagine your dance group in the newspaper, in the website of Healthway, everywhere. Oh, it's going to be published. Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. And then the second the Second price. is 40,000 okay. and then 25 for the third place. Wow, not bad. And, and how long is the dance? A three minute, four minute type? Oh, thing? I think it's three to five. I, I, I'm not so sure. About I forgot. The mechanics, I right, forgot. Right, right. Yeah. No worries, no worries. Mm -hmm. But again, at the end of the day, it's like it really promotes a lot of the, you know, you expel energy. Of you're, course. you're dancing with the team. It's, it's, it's actually inspiring other people and you're earning money. It's, it's a sharing of your talent. Right, at right. the same time, motivating other people to stay active and healthy. And then at the end of the day, if you're so good, then you get the 75,000. Right. And just to share, of course, I was uh, very lucky, fortunate to be a part of Dance for Health 2 last year. Of course. And then it was, it was held in Glorieta. And it was really crazy because in between, we had we had Zumba. Yes. It will happen on Saturday. Of also. course. Yeah. And uh, we wanted it 30 minutes before the judging and then 30 minutes after. So we can all dance. So again, for those of you who would like to check it out, you know, you get to, you get to watch a series of amazing corporate um, like really dance, show off their dance yes, moves on the yes. floor. And aside from that, if you really want to get up and go, you could also join. Because again, um, going for the Zumba is free, right? I mean, yes, the participants it's free. individuals don't have to sign up. Yeah, it's for free. So join us. Uh, watch the, the show for free. And then um, get excited with the dancers in case you're interested. Look at your com potential competitors, right, fill right, them, right. and then at the same time, wear your Zumba outfit so that you can Zumba with us. Okay, and then we do have questions with regard to, um, again, aside from schools, can can they also be a non-corporate uh, mm -hmm. kind of, of institution, like for example, non-profit organizations, yeah. they want to join also? Uh, we had, as I mentioned, uh, when we started Dance for Health, we had three segments, the corporations, the students, and the community, or the NGOs. Right. But um, we decided to focus on corporations. But if there's really a need, why not? Okay. Maybe in the in Dance for Health 4. four. Right, right, yeah. right. Okay, um, I think we have time just for one more question. And uh, this question goes to uh, Miss Sarah. Miss Sarah from Alabang is watching right now and she wanted to find out. Um, she's a mom of five kids. Mm -hmm. Wow. And then she goes, Miss um, Carms, I just watched the whole show. And then she said that uh, she hasn't had an executive checkup for three uh -huh. years. Um, and her kids would like to also join a Dance for Health competition. Oh. So hopefully open a junior division, they're requesting. Um, it's a good idea. And then, and then... I mean, you're going to have a junior checkup, right? Yes. So you could have all your, you know, uh -huh. junior checkup um, clients actually join it also. Correct. And be ambassadors right. of Healthway. Uh -huh. yeah. Exactly. Um, and then, uh, so Miss Sarah is asking, uh, what tips 
could you actually give um, single moms, moms, parents to have still the energy to work mm -hmm. and at the same time still play, have time to play with their kids? Okay. Um, number one is decide that you want that. Okay. Decide that you really want it. Because when I um, decided to um, work hard, have time with my kids, with my husband, have time for myself, that's the only time I got all, all those things. Yeah, but it's not that difficult. You just have to make sure that you like it so, so badly. And then, because we all have, we are, we are all given 24 hours a day. I'm not getting 48 hours per day. It's just 24 hours. So it's just my decision to have time for myself, for my family, for my office mate, and everyone else. So you decide. You can start very crudely, put your itinerary perhaps. Like 7 to 8 in the morning, I'm going to dance for one hour, and then 8 o'clock, I'll cook. And then, you know, you just have to decide that you like it bad enough, and then do it. Okay, we actually have um, breast cancer survivors also tuning in. Mm -hmm. um, we have um, Ellen and uh, Nina, and they're saying that um, what Miss Carm, what you're saying actually is also very inspiring mm -hmm. because they started just uh, leading a healthy lifestyle towards the latter part, like oh. around uh, 40s, um, mm -hmm. late, late 40s. So they found out that they had breast cancer and they said that um, they would love to read your book. You okay. know, the, the uh -huh. positivity, they want to read that. It would actually mm -hmm. help also. So thank you guys so much for watching. Um, again, Ms. Carms, maybe you'd like to invite them for the last time? All right. Uh, I want to invite everyone not just to watch the show, but to stay healthy. Stay healthy, as, um, as um, Nina and Ellen. The, Ellen mentioned that, um, well, it's kind of late because they had the sickness already. So to, to all healthy people out there. Who aren't sick yet. Who aren't sick yet. You don't have to wait. Just go on and um, start the healthy habit. Um, as I mentioned seed, you know, sleep, right, sleep, eat right, exercise, de-stress, and think positive. I think that's very important. So that's my invitation to everyone. And uh, visit Healthway. If there's a need for you to see the doctor, um, try to see the Healthway doctor. And then, of course, um, to those who are interested to join, sorry, but it's kind of late. But if you really want, message me. I might consider. Um, but to everyone, please watch. If you can drop by at Alabang Town Center and um, try to witness it for yourself, try to see it for yourself, it's going to be a day of fun. It's on Saturday already, 1 o'clock in the afternoon. So watch them and then uh, cheer for them. All right. Thank you so much, Ms. Carmi. I mean, um, thank you. And maybe, you know, we'd like to also thank, you know, Healthway Medical, Ms. Carms, for, for being here. You're very busy. Of course, your husband is here also. Oh, yes. Um, He's very supportive. You have a major supporter. And also, your, your, your team is here. Oh, yeah. PRC uh, is yeah, here. Yeah, PRC. And of course, um, hopefully, we get to see all of you guys in Alabang Town Center. That's this Saturday already at 1 o'clock. Yes. And we'll all be there. I hope you guys could join us. Check it out. And if you know you haven't had an annual checkup, don't be scared um, because it, it's nothing intrusive. There's no operations that's going to happen. It's half day. You'll be finished by half day. Right, right, right. So if you want, bring a friend. So at least you're not alone going oh, yeah. to the annual checkup. Uh -huh. And then uh, you'll see you're going to get addicted to the whole hotels. Um, that will be you know, <laughs> our reward after every... A particular checkup. Now, to all of you guys who's been watching the workplace, thank you so very much. A happy new year to all of you. Um, to the sponsors, thank you guys so very much. David Salon, Urban Astro Manila. Um, we'd like to thank also Healthway Medical. We'd like to thank uh, the People Management Association of the Philippines. Um, all the supporters who've been uh, sending us emails and text messages. Thank you guys so very much. For all of my gowns, Miss Michelle Lim, thank you so very much. Um, and everybody has been sending me a lot of crazy love via text and email. You guys are the best. Um, again, I'm Mary Beth Nate and we'll see you again next uh, Monday and hello to Manila Dragons and to all of the paddlers in uh, of course um, throughout the Philippines we're very excited for the international race of Boracay very very soon so stay tuned for that and a whole lot more happy 2016 bye guys